had seven, <laughs> putting it down when it counts. There are few things as magical as a sunrise in Jackson Hole, Wyoming. And what better way to spend a Friday than at the Yeti Natural Selection? We needed the last 72 hours, not just for the snow to reset, but also for the athletes uh, to reset. TDIF, thank goodness it's finals. We've got a nice little balmy five degree day up here. I completely agree. We are also moving to the left side of the course. Conditions are gonna be a lot better. We are going to witness the heaviest head-to-head -head matchups. We started this event with 24 riders on day one, but there can only be one champion. It is go time. Jared Elston, the first person to go through. We're gonna see if Craven can force a tie break. Audible frustration. Jared did what he needed to do. Toy Stein Horg mode. Ooh. Backside oh. seven sits it down. Did he leave the door open for Travis? This man had food poisoning that ruined him for the last 24 hours. Didn't know if he'd be able to run today and is somehow here performing at this level. Toy Stein Horg mode here. He's in go mode. Knew that Torstein Travis was gonna be <laughs> a battle. We got more snowboarding. Great, Taking great. it to three. We're going again. Travis has the benefit of getting to watch what Torstein is going to do. He just went all out. We saw Travis in the tiebreaker in the opening round. Can he do it again? That was a ferocious slam. Well, we are sad to say goodbye to Travis. What a matchup. It's been an honor to call it. Nickelbang against the local Blake Paul. Woo, that's well, a rush. Blake Paul, he is a fan favorite. The first backcountry jumps he ever hit were right here at Jackson Hall. What? This is an incredible first run. Dude, you're like one of the smoothest riders out there for sure. Nickel with nothing to lose. Putting it down when it counts. More snowboarding. Nickel bang on course. Backside 720, Nickel goes down. It ain't over though. Blake Paul, he would like nothing more than to advance. Look at the control and poise he has in between those features. Critical choices that Mikkel made off the top get him to advance. Ooh, boy. Redemption heat, isn't it, from last year? It is, it is. Ben Ferguson versus Sage Kotzenberg. They're homies, but no love lost today. Ben Ferguson is here to win. Not able to ride out clean, but continuing on. It's getting more and more challenging. Sage Gotzenberg looking to close the door. Sage is through. And that friendly rivalry continues. Pleasure riding. It is Bluebird, it is crispy outside, and we could not be more excited to see what the women are going to put down. This first heat will be Elena Height versus Hannah Beeman, and then our second heat will be Robin Van Jan versus Marion Herity. There she goes, opening up a new feature. Back up to the top where we have Hannah Beeman. She has to win this one to advance to the finals. I love that we've got the riders mic'd up again. Oh, oh God. Oh. Whoa. Shit. I think we can all relate to uh, a run like that. Congratulations, Elena. Thank you. And congratulations to you yeah, as well. Here we have Robin Van Jane. She's last year's overall tour champion. She can't hold back to beat Marion. Oh! Yeah, but a 
of course, if there is someone who is a consummate competitor and knows how to deal with pressure, it is Marion Erti. Oh, oh Marion. Yeah. Adding a frontside three to this run. Robin Van Jin to the final. We are getting ready for men's semifinals right now. On one side of the brackets, you've got the newcomer. And on the other side of the brackets, you got the veterans. I think Jared wants it. He wants it bad. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> you know, I think this just shows if you are dropping against Torstein Horgmo, you know you have to send it from the very top. Whew, that was chaotic. Torstein seriously opened it up in the earlier heats. He is one of those individuals that has that kind of turbo mode. <laughs> Oh, man, getting eaten up by the snakes. Ooh. Torstein definitely feeling it right now. Yeah, I'm good. I just need myself in the face pretty good. Oh. Wow. Oh Jared God. Elston will be heading into finals at his first showing wow. at the natural selection. Our second matchup, a very heavy head-to-head, -head, Sage Kotzenberg versus Mikkel Bang. God. Let's talk about that. That was insane. But he has to go head to head against the 2021 tour champion and veritable legend, Mikkel Bang. Oh. This is a much more cut and dry semifinals. I haven't had a tumble like that in years. Sage is going to be the one to advance. We are going to go to a tiebreaker. Elena versus Robin in finals. That is a heavy matchup. All right, Elena Height dropping in for the first run of women's finals. Woo. No. Explain to the viewers at home who are unfamiliar with variable snow conditions. When you're in fresh, deep powder, the deep snow acts as your natural speed control. Whereas here, you're hammering on top of these tracks and you have to actively slow yourself down from feature to feature or you're gonna overshoot. And let's not forget as well, the temperature's changing all the time. So it's not like you can dial in an approach early and that's how it is for the rest of the day. It's constantly changing. That was a lot of savage tomahawks. Oh shit, let's go get them. I think Elena will force a tie break. Absolutely. That could just be us wishing for more snowboarding. Robin Van Jin trying to take home the win. You can just see the exhaustion as she's just trying to navigate down this bottom half of the course. All right, there you have it. A tiebreaker, round three. This is it, winner takes all. You got Robin Van Jin dropping after you. You got to max this thing out. Backside 360, and she puts it down clean. Final run, one champion crowned. Robin Van Jin would like a say in this outcome. Oh. Here's Elena, congratulations. To win this event doesn't even really feel real. Well, congratulations, you deserve another cheers and a million more. Hats off to Robin though, who said, I'm not going conservative. What a story, Jared Elston facing Sage Kotzenberg, about to battle it out for the number one spot. Sage, cab nine. This is what Travis Rice wanted when he created this event. Jared Elston is on course, double backflip. Coming for you now. Yep. No, you got it. Good luck, boys. Yeah. Good luck. Good luck. This ain't a victory lap. This is the one contest he's never won, and he wants to win it. Coming in switch, and he goes cab 900. Sage Kotzenberg wants to end it now. Could you imagine what that energy is like? The world's best are in this temple of Stoke and sending you out. Jared Elston, double wildcat. Backside 720, and he stomps it! This is incredible. Oh. 
Just shy. So good, man. We got ourselves a champion. Sage Cotton, bro. This is for Mike McKelvey. Walking with the win is, it's unreal. All of you at home watching around the world, this one is for you. Thanks for hanging out and watching the best snowboarders on the planet. We will see you in Canada.